three. Hello, Rainbow Loom families. My name is Caitlin, and I'm going to be showing you how to how to make the unicorn mane bracelet. Now, we will um we will need a hook, one of these, a loom, or your fingers. We will start. Well, you can do it in any version, fingers, fishtail helper, or loom. Today, I'm going to be showing you in the loom version. Today, um, we are going to be making this bracelet. This is the unicorn main bracelet. It's a very cool bracelet that I decided to show you. You need, if you are using the loom, if you're righty or lefty, you need your arrows, your little things, pegs, in the little open area, pointing to your lefty or righty way. Whatever you, whatever direction you write with a pencil. You're going to start by taking a pink, pink card band. Well, for me, it is pink. But for you, it might not be pink. See, like that. We are going to make an eight. Next, I'm going to take my yellow band. By the way, you will need four colors. You can pause the video here if your rubber bands are not ready. Next, you are going to put your yellow rubber band on like that. And then, green for me. Now, wrap it like that. You're going to do all of the rest of your rubber bands except for your pink rubber band. Zeros. Like that. And then, I'm not using this today. I was just showing you that you ha that if you are doing it with that, you have to use it. I'm going to take my hook or my fingers. If you prefer hook or finger, I prefer hook. You are going to take your pink band and wrap it over. And then, you are going to take the other band. The other pink band on the other side and wrap it over like that. Then you're going to push your bands down. Then you're going to grab a pink band. And now here's the part that you have to remember. We have to make this bracelet good. It's going to turn out straight rubber bands. Oops, daisies, I dropped my hook. Then we are going to Grab the middle band over here, which is green for me. Lift it over. But on this side, this side peg, you're going to grab the bottom band over here, which is yellow for me. I tried to get it. And then you're going to lift it over just like that. Then you're going to stretch your bands like that. It makes it seem easier by putting them down. Then you're going to grab your yellow band and put it over. But this time, instead of putting, instead of grabbing the white one, which is the middle one, you're going to grab the green one over here in the middle, like that. Lift it over and put it on like that. Then you're going to take the yellow band that's on the other side over, not put. Such as like that. Then you're going to push your bands down, which for me, I like to do it this way. Pulling the bottom band for eight. And then we will take this bracelet, and bracelet, sorry, guys, bracelet, uh, rubber band, and we are going to do it on this side now. Now, your bands are going to turn out straight when you finish making this bracelet. I'm only making a small version. Oops, up, 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 up. I did, yep, I did the right one. Like this one. Small version. Um, you can make a big, big version to fit you. If you want to pause the video here, those are all the steps that you need to make a big, big version. Um, so yeah. But I'm going to make another a, another small version and just keep going. So I'm going to kind of oops started on the wrong part. Go 
to know that sides. Me too. Well, I made this bracelet up, so I can't remember that well. This morning, I um, wake up early, so um, I kind of want. I like to make bracelets sometimes. So I make a bracelet every time. Oops, wrong color. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. So I. This bracelet is um, a very good bracelet. I made it up. It's very cool. Made it up. You should try to make up a bracelet of your own. Or maybe a family member can help you make up a bracelet if they know a lot about rainbow things and rainbow balloon rubber bands and stuff. What I do know is that you can make up any rainbow balloon bracelet, no matter if it's gold, pink, brown, black any color you can also even use your rubber bands at home to make this bracelet if you don't have any rainbow loom rubber bands you can use the normal rubber bands hmm. and you're going to take oh nope, 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 green for me sorry my dad just made a whistle sound one two three four and we are, oh yeah, my dad's right behind me, so yeah, he's just watching me do this video. And I think he is leaving right now. I am just um, doing my bracelet, and my sister is um, changing into one of her gowns. Like that. <laughs> if you watch me on Rainbow Loom, I might post another video. But for now, this is my first video. I've never posted a Rainbow Loom video before in my life. If I am only making a small one, it will not take me that long. So like I said, you should pause the video. And if you do not pause the video, um, you can make a small one, like this one. This one is kind of like a ring. See the easy sorry. By the way, this is my rainbow loop kit. It has lace rubber bands in them. I like my rubber bands. Um, they um, come for me and, well, they come for me because um, my pet Zeke had died before and I just like how they come for me. They I like making them. Well, my sister has one too. They, um, well, it's not actually my sister's, it's actually mine. Well, I gave it to her since I got this big set for my birthday. Um, and you can kind of see my face. Um, I'm right here. Way. Um, by the way, I like to say it by the way a lot. Um, and if you are ready to do undo your bracelet, I will show you that at the end. Um, <clears throat> I don't know if my dad will come up here soon. Um, I have no clue what's happening. Well, today I was riding my bike. I like to ride bikes a lot. Well, we had to keep space a lot. So, um, uh, um, one second. I got to tell something to my dad for a second. Um, let me, can you stay here until I'm done? Yeah. Okay, right, back. <laughs> Just got to tell my dad something. So, my dad has also been riding his bike, too. Uh, well, our house is kind of um, big right now. We just FaceTimed with one of my cousins. It was her birthday. So, yeah. Like that. Um, yes. And we have had been very fun. We have had, we had been um, hiking a lot. So we had gone hiking one time on the trail and biking a lot. It was very fun to do that. Also, one or two more than me. Um, we um love the Rainbow Loom. I love the Rainbow Loom videos. I um I still play them for me to learn new bracelets. Um, you can read new bracelets too if you just tell RainbowLoom.com. You can just go to rainbowloom.com bracelets 
and get this bracelet or I will post it out there. And then when you are done, I'm going to stop here. When you are done, make sure you pay attention to this. I'm going to zoom in closer. You're going to take your rubber, all your rubber bands from each side and pull them over. All three rubber bands from each side. Oh, except for the pink one. Except for the top one, I mean. The top one stays. You sometimes you might want to use your hand just to pull them over. And then, it doesn't matter what you have, S-clip or C-clip, whatever you prefer. Um, you can take your bracelet and wrap it on one peg, only one peg. And then, you can take it off the loom. And then, you're going to take your S-clip which mine is an S-clip, and then you're going to take the other side, your bracelet like that, and then you're going to put the S-clip on the other side. This, now, this is my bracelet. These are my unicorn main bracelets. I hope you had a very fun time with me today. I do hope you had a good time. Goodbye.